What's up, y'all? It is June 30th, and we're gonna be starting a new compost bin, so I figured I'd bring y'all along. Let's check her out. A few different things have happened that have um, kind of coalesced in bringing about this, this new compost bin. Of course, one, you know, I've used a, a fair amount of the old compost. We're ready to start a new bay because this is pretty much ready underneath, but I keep putting new stuff on it, which I don't want to do. I have a lot of uh, brown or carbon preamble because I kind of feel a little bit weird about showing you my compost because it's, it's, it's almost like seeing your dirty clothes. Woohoo! In last year's compost, I, I found a potato. <laughs> it's pretty cute. Same time, I'm rather enthralled by that because that means it overwintered. I wonder if I could put that back in the dirt. <laughs> I saw uh, some, some earwigs making their escape from the compost that I shoveled up and one went under so I went to look at it and uh, you see that found its way right into a spider web look at that eh how remarkable is that yeah that earwig doesn't have a chance in hell eh Everywhere is interesting if you if you believe it to be or better yet if you allow it to be okay I took a scrape here You know playing the archaeologist we can say that, that soil type looks different So we've hit the natural earth So what I'll do is actually leave that last little bit of layer there to be kind of like a starter We're gonna be adding compost into the new compost. We're gonna go a little bit layer by layer I have a lot of dry woody stuff pepper plants from last year. I've got some some kale Where's the kale? There's kale down there. And we're gonna do, you know, a layer of brown stuff. Then we're gonna get some, some green, brown, green, brown, green, and see how high we can go. We're gonna have the majority of it being brown right now. You might recall back in the spring when I pulled all the mulch off my beds, I didn't wanna put it all on the compost and I would be adding it a uh, little bit by little. I just took a big shovel full and what's really nice is that straw has pretty much composted down as well. Like not completely, but it's working towards it, right? Look at that, right? So uh, I think this is gonna be a pretty speedy bin because we've got, you know, already some, some uh, well on its way compost. Well, what fucking light uh, stuff that it's already, you know, half composted. I hope that went in. Okay, so we have uh, pretty good kind of super layers so far. A lot of that uh, half composted straw has really um, pushed down a lot of those branches and that's exactly what we want. But I only had that one bucket of compost so far. So actually what I'm gonna do now is start pulling a little bit from the other pile. But we'll just transfer over here so that we can let this bin just do its own thing for the next couple of weeks until it's finished. So we're gonna call it on that. I've got a couple more things to add to this one. This one I'm gonna take the opportunity to give it like one, uh, another turn before we leave it for a little bit. This one is probably 90% done. It just needs a little bit more. This one uh, looks really nice, but of course there's a lot of full on um, stuff that still needs to be broken down in that one. I will be kind of showing a little bit how this progresses over the summer. So make sure you hit subscribe so you can follow along to see how this all pans out. Otherwise, thanks for watching. If you're not doing it, you're not doing it right. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.